right, so today what we're gonna do is we're gonna compare a couple of different types of grease gun fittings, not the Zerk fittings, but the fittings that actually go on your grease gun. So I have my grease gun here today, and I also have two different styles. I have a lock and lube, which is kind of the name brand. It's, it's what a lot of different people use. And then I have another one called a Varsk. And they operate just a, just a hair differently. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna send these two through their paces and we're gonna see which one we like better as we grease the RV. So let's get to it. All right, so we've got a grease fitting here, a Zerk fitting on the bottom of this jack that we need to grease. Squeeze the handle, hook it on that Zerk fitting, let off the handle. And now this, the grease gun now is connected to that Zerk fitting, it's not gonna come off. So uh, as of right now, I really like this. Haven't tried the other one yet. I like this a whole lot better than the standard fitting where you have to push it on and then it can pop off and you have to pull it off by pulling to the side. With this, you just loosen by squeezing the, the trigger and pulling that off. Really like that. All right, now I've got the Varsk and we're gonna use this to grease the same jack. Last time, uh, last time I did this, I didn't fill it up with grease. So now we're gonna do this one rather than pulling the trigger down we push the trigger up and that releases the zerk fitting on the inside we can now put that on the grease zerk and close it it's locked on the grease zerk and now we can pump some grease in there all right to take it off we'll lift up on that that will release and now we can take this off so now you've seen this demonstration of the lock and lube and now this varsk end so now that I've used this on a couple of grease zerks, let's, uh, let's stand up, let's get outside, and let's talk about exactly what I like and what I don't like. <laughs> okay, so after almost two years of using these and switching them back and forth between the Lock and Lube and the Varsk, just to decide which one I like better, I'm gonna have to go with the Lock and Lube. It's more expensive, it is the name brand, but it's a whole lot easier to use. It's very quick. Uh, the thumb depression system just grabs on to the Zerk fitting and, and that's super simple. I will say I did like, uh, what I do like about the Varsk is that once you, once you lock it on, it won't come off. The problem is that it is so long from here to here. So that, that distance is so long and a lot of grease fittings, a lot of Zerk fittings are in real small, hard to get places. A matter of fact, I have a, a few that I can't even get to with this, so I have to use kind of the old school, have to take this off, put the old one on and just kind of push it on to see if I can get it there because the distance here is just too long to fit in those little tight places. But when it comes down to the less expensive Varsk grease fitting uh, from Amazon or the name brand Lock and Lube, RV Pastor Kevin is gonna have to go with the lock and lube as the easiest and the best. This is not sponsored. This is not, they, nobody gave me anything. I bought these both on my own. And I have just found that over the past couple of years, using this has just been my go-to. It makes it a whole lot easier. And uh, I don't, I have yet to have this pop off once I lock it onto a grease fitting. So with that, if you're looking at either one of these, I'm gonna recommend this. Uh, but I'm also going to recommend that you make it to church on Sunday.